Today's topic. Instead of despair, do you keep patience? Hello, and thank you for tuning in to Heart to Heart. My name is Elaine Enriquez, and it's always a joy to spend this time with you. The topic of conversation. Instead of despair, do you keep patience? I ask you once again, do you keep patience instead of despair? Patience is unpredictable depending on the severity of the situation. It is important to understand that patience is part of the process of waiting for something you long for. In a world where most things can be accomplished quickly, it predisposes us to be impatient. Being in a place of restlessness can cause us to act in a non-productive way. Tempers rise. Actions become even harsh against something or someone. You cannot see clearly because thoughts become cloudy, causing the body to go into torment. These are moments where you must take a break to reflect and to turn to your inner being, to lean on the Word of God. Present the situation to our beloved Jesus. He intercedes for us at all times and places. When we recognized that in those moments of help, He has the answer, not always the answer we will get is the one we want the most, but always keep in mind that there will be an answer. I will show you in the Word what God tells us about patience. Let's go to Proverbs 14, verse 29. In the New International Version, He who is patient shows great discernment. He who is aggressive shows much foolishness. Follow the divine advice. You will have understanding. God loves you, and so do I. I invite you to follow us through our social network community. Subscribe to our YouTube channel on OVM Radio. Now is a good time. Where there is much more of our programming. If you enjoy these segments, where the heart of the Father touches the heart of man, click the bell for more notifications of the segment Heart to Heart, available to you. If you need us to support you in prayer, write to us your request to the following email, ovmprayforme at gmail.com. Leave us a message to know where you see and hear us. I would love to greet you in the next segment of Heart to Heart. God bless you. I'll see you soon.